And we're back, folks. Hello, hello. Just finishing up a cigarette here. So, when last we left off, we had uh, done some stuff around the city here. Also, I marked down some locations. The uh, fact that there's a gun in this house, the car's down there, the gas station, the prison's over here, and this is a police station and a fire station. So we want to go kind of down here, loot those two places, um, and then go to the prison and see if we can maybe find any more guns in there. Uh, but first things first, what we want to do is clean the blood off of ourselves, because that makes us a little unhappy. So first of all, let's go ahead and fill this. Take a drink, and then let's see, what do we have that's bloody? Foreman vest. And our hard hat. And our jeans. And our leather gloves. And the leather jacket, of course. And our boots. All right. That should be everything. Perfect. Okay. So, before we sneak on out of here, let's just go over everything again. We have a wound to our right hand. Not too big of a deal, but... You know, whatever. We have uh, our cigarettes and lighter. We have a bunch of food that we've been holding on to. Uh, we do have a pistol that we could use if necessary. We have some vitamins here, which are going to help us too much. Um, and of course, we have some uh, 45 rounds there. But uh, yeah, we have our <clears throat> police baton nightstick thing here. And we're just going to go ahead and try get to the drugstore today Let's see how that works out for us all right let's jump this fence no one's around perfect I'll just sneak on past here We need to go... Actually, where do we need to go? We need to go here-ish. Yeah, so we don't need to go this far. We got where we were at for a minute there. I have to get stat points anyway, so... Take a little wide berth around that. Okay... I don't think I opened either of these when I was in there. I should have. Yeah, I definitely should have when I went through the uh, the Zippos. Should have opened up the back door here. Hopefully that doesn't come to bite me in the ass. Let's see. All right. Luckily, we don't have really anything crazy here. We're going to go in through this area. I think that would work for us. And if we can open this door... That'll lead us out here where we can unlock this door. Now it's just unlocked. The same to this one here. Okay. So if I remember correctly, I think this is going to be the clinic, maybe? Maybe I'm wrong. Looks like just offices at the moment. Maybe it's one more over. It could just be a little clinic of some sort. Although, this could be the law office as well. If that is here. Go one more down then. Not there, but over here. All right. Carefully. And close the door behind us. Get some supply areas. Ooh, we hit the jackpot here. Kind of. This is the medical area. There we go. That's what we needed. Suture needles. Those will come in handy. I say noodles or needles. Ugh. Oop. 
Got some more glue, which is nice. Ooh, I should grab that lighter too. Just to have another. Okay. This room first. More glue. Excellent. Take some vitamins. All right, let's rock. This room now. All right, perfect. This room should have some drugs in it, I'd hope. Painkillers. I don't need another suture needle holder. I will take one of these tweezers, though. Here's the good stuff. Don't need the cotton balls, though. trash can anything in that garbage bag all right we're on to the next room oh -ho. perfect there we go grab all that we should be okay on some uh, medical supplies for right now that'll be great Perfect. I'm going to grab these uh, empty bottles, fill them up as well. If we have some extra water lying around, I think it would be a good idea, right? that off and there's one more room here to search okay love to see it <clears throat> i said love to see it bring that stuff over please we're getting overweight now so we will have to, to hurry this along oh looks like that is full now I grab a holder? No, I just grab needles. Okay, good. I just need one of the suture needle holders, so works out. And then we have this shelf here, which has all kinds of goodies in it. Perfect. All right, we are starting to get very, very weighed down. So if we encounter a, I don't know why there's just one of those there. Counter any zombies, we're gonna have a bad time. Infectant. I think there's a band aid right there. Yep. And that looks like a suture wire as well. Excellent. And we'll just go ahead and take a peek at these. I don't think there's gonna be anything we need. Nope. All right. I'm sure it's just a bathroom, right? Yeah. Okay. Nothing in there. All right. Let's head out the back. So from here, we're gonna go down to the truck so we can drop stuff off. So we just need to go basically kitty corner to here. Hopefully we can sneak past the uh, Zippos here without having too much worry. Don't see any zombies at least. Right here anyway. exhausted because I'm sprinting like that. Fortunate. As we'll head down this road again. Maybe cut through some of the backyards here. It sucks to be this overweight. Not great. 
Um, am I carrying any food that I could just eat real quick? Well, I could, but it's not going to lower my thing by anything meaningful. Saw a zombie there. Yep. It doesn't look like a skirt. Looks like pants to me. Okay, so I think what we'll do we'll drop stuff off at the truck and then since our original house that we were spawned in is nearby it we can go there to rest for the night. Check the map real quick, like we gotta go down here. Zombies are gonna see me, but I can lose them quite easily in this area. The main thing is getting rid of all the stuff we're carrying that is heavy. Um, we cannot move very fast right now. If you look at this, we are down by 30% speed, which is not great. So as long as there's no zombies around us here, we should be fine. Yeah, they're all screwing off over that way. All right, <clears throat> start at the top. We'll go down to the cigarettes area. I'm just going to throw stuff in the trunk here. Gotta go. We managed to get some, but not all. Can I jump this fence? I can. Oh, yes. Gotta go, though. Okay. Um, What do we have that I can use? Do a painkiller. Okay, let's let's do this. Mm -mm. Painkiller. And we'll take some beta blockers. Um, we're not unhappy, so we don't need those. Otics. Do we have? What they be at? Vitamin. Take some vitamins. I think our main issue is that we're exhausted right now. That's 80%. Let's jump this fence. Ow. What really weighs a lot here? Probably all this canned stuff, I would say. If I can get back to the truck and offload some of that. Sit down to the next level of stuff. Okay, they're coming for me. Truck's also full, so we don't have too much left we can deal with there. Go ahead and uh, eat this real quick. And we might as well try to get well fed, because if we're well fed, then we have that extra little bit of movement, not movement, but uh, weight we can carry. There we go. Alright, turn that off. I was going to sit down for a second, but that's not going to help me right there. Alright. Jump this. Let's turn. Sit on the ground. A bit of time for a moment. And get up. Trying to chillax for a little bit here. So that way our guy has some time to rest. So hopefully we can get rid of that, but I don't think it's gonna work. Let's just down a bunch of vitamins. Okay. If we can jump this fence here. Oh, perfect. The zombies won't be able to get to us, but we can rest here. Have some more pills. Let's have a smoke while we're waiting. All right. Where are we at? 
Zombies all over there. They decided to stop, I guess. Well, fine. Works for us in a way. Yeah, I don't think we can get rid of this moderate exertion now. We're just tired. And uh, that means we won't be able to regain anything. Got some jelly beans. Jump this fence right here. And that one zombie come to us, hopefully. Not that one. This guy. We can lure him to us. Jump him over the fence. We can probably just stomp him out. And we can go into this house and rest for the night, hopefully. Wasn't all according to plan, but that's how stuff goes sometimes. into this house by opening a window. There we go. We'll go ahead and close this behind us. Like that. There we go. Okay, that guy's dead. Perfect. West Point map. Wouldn't read that real quick. I did see a zombie moving outside there uh, just a moment ago. Are those clothes over there? Weird. Anyway. Go ahead and uh, find a room to sleep in for now. Right here works. Let's sleep. I was hoping we would sleep for a little longer than that, but what happens sometimes, I suppose, huh? Got ourselves a nice little smoke. And we will eat some snow globes. Why not? Get rid of some of that. Alright. Before we go out there, let's let's search this house. Because it'd be nice if we can get back to the truck. We'll have to use the uh, the seats for storage now that the back is filled up. If we had a moment of safety, we could go through the stuff we picked up and actually look and see if there's, you know, anything we have that's unnecessary. Actually, real quick before we walk away from this, fill up our water bottle. Drink. And how's our clothing doing? Leather jacket is bloody. Let's go ahead and wash. Leather jacket. Anything else bloody? No, just dirty. Okay, that's fine with me. Also, while I have a moment, I guess what I could do... Is shove this stuff into my bag, which should decrease my weight even further. Which means we'll actually be able to walk around normally now. With no negative effects. What do we got in here? Okay. Nothing. People aren't very American. They don't have guns in their uh, house. We didn't really search the first floor here, because we were... Is that bleach on the floor? Ah, so that guy must have drank bleach and killed himself, huh? Knitting needles, huh? Okay. 
Okay, where's the key right here? Finally, a fanny pack. Oh my god. You do not know how long I've waited for one of these so I can put my lighter and cigarettes inside of it. Also, my pen and eraser. So it's all in there, safe. Ready to go. Cool. Anything in here? Medical supplies, I'll take them. Okay. Lastly, let's check this uh, house. For, of course, more canned goods. They're gonna weigh us down, but... Kinda have to just grab anything we can take at this point. Let's check the fridge and we'll eat whatever's in here for our breakfast. We are well fed, which increases our capacity a bit. Okay. Let's eat this cheese, why not? Alright. Looking outside, it looks like things are clear. Let's try and get back to the vehicle. Worst case scenario, when we are inside putting stuff into the uh, seat and the glove box, we can just drive away with it, which I think we're actually going to leave with it here. So, a moment while I check the map. It is basically right down the street, right, okay. Assuming there's no zombies around it. We can deal with one or two. Huge horde I do not want to deal with. Looks like we are decent right now. We do have a little bit that we can try to store here. There we go. Ideally, I'd like to get like a, a van or something we could use. That'd be very good if we could do that. We can store everything else we can in here before the zombies get wise and decide to try to uh, come at me. And it's really taking a while to store all this on. Too much junk. There we go. Everything's out. All right. Um, I guess I should store these two, and then I can take half back. There we go. Now we have some water stored in our truck, in case we need to use it. All right. The engine on this is not good. I would definitely want to find a van, like one of the panel ones or one of the uh, other ones, but oh shit, that's a lot of zombies. Check the map real quick, I think. Yeah, right here's the firehouse and stuff, so if we can just avoid hitting a couple of zombies, drive up into here. Oh my god, the brakes did not... Oh, the brakes on this suck. What an awful thing. The doors are open. Anything good in these? Nothing good at all. Matches. about to say, I don't hear anyone smacking on the walls yet. That looks like it's just an office. Where is that back there, though? I'm looking for, like, a uh, locker room. If I can get a uniform. This. Oh, what do we have in here? Duct tape? Take it. Cleaning liquid and stuff. Don't care about that. This is a conference room, it looks like. Here's the garage. Also that pole there. 
or duct tape. Perfect. Don't really need any of that. I don't remember if I have a wrench yet, but I should probably get one to do some mechanic stuff, right? Oh, here's some lockers down here. Here we go. Now let's wear this stuff. Go ahead and get rid of those. Military boots we already have. Dang, not a whole lot. We got some better pants, at least, but... I don't know how often we're actually going to be getting hit on by people in the legs there. Got the laundry room. And we got some more stuff in here. Expectant. Uh, medical supplies. We'll take everything except for the cotton balls. Medical corset, huh? Again, everything but the cotton balls. You never know where we're going to find more medical supplies, so it's always good to take what we can now. Finally. Yep. Annex level 2. Don't really care. Uh, propane torch and a welder's mask. I'll grab both of those. Also grab that metal bar. That's a weapon. Okay, what's back here? Probably parts. Ooh, there we go. Our powder jacket. Might as well make the full ensemble, right? Let's go ahead and put that on too. Why not? Get rid of those. All right. Um. Load blocks. An axe. Oh, that's uh, conditions not very well. I might as well not. I can take out the pipe wrench, though. Okay. Nothing in the trash, right? Not really. Oop. Other door, please. Now let's head up to the second floor. Attacked. Not that one. Bathrooms. Why am I tired already? Shower, huh? Check the other one real quick. That's a bigger shower. Alright, what do we got in here? We got a denim shirt. That'll uh help us as well. I don't know if it's worth getting multiple. I don't think it is. Alright, nothing else in here. We can sleep in the firehouse, which is nice, which we might actually just do right now. No point in not doing it, right? Hmm. Maybe we didn't get a full night's rest or something and we just, like, fell asleep too early or woke up too early. Should still be a here we go kitchen. Perfect. And then also a area down there that looks like it's other stuff. Leisure area. All right. Um, we'll take those. Then there. 
the juice bar. We can take that. I forget which one that is. I don't have one. All right, what do we got this fresh? We got cheese. We got grapes. We got a radish. What's frozen? Ooh, ooh shrimp. Meat patty. Nice. Can't eat more food? <laughs> that makes a difference. The radishes are like garbage food anyway, so. Actually, it really doesn't matter. Instant popcorn in the bookshelf? Weird location for that to be. Can I slide down this? No? Oh, that's just not cool. Right, let's go ahead and smoke since we're a little anxious now. I think I just stopped smoking the cigarette. Nope, I actually finished it. Cool. Alright. Before we leave, let's refill our water. Drink first, and then fill it. Alright. No, this way, you, you fool. Well, up here he comes. It just took him a minute. There we go, shit. <clears throat> Exit stage right. Let's not use the garage door that's loud and big. Let's go out around this way. I assume if I find a car key somewhere around here, it's gotta be one of the cars that are nearby, right? Is it this one? No, so is it that one? I was hoping it was like a van or something, but it doesn't look like that's gonna be the case. Nothing of importance in there. Okay. All right, let's store what we got. Luckily, we can store what we got while moving. I think I, I might have already grabbed like a wrench and stuff, but I don't remember if we did or not for sure. Fuck, it takes so long to turn off the brakes. Not to turn off the brakes, but to hit the brakes. And out we go. Considering I'm wearing um, firefighter gear, but it's supposed to be like water resistant. I'm surprisingly so, aren't I? Be open, be open, yeah, boy. All right. search all these, maybe see if they have a gun or something in them. This is a cop shop. More cigarettes, then I'll take them. I think I'll also grab another red pen, because I think mine is getting a little uh, ill here. We can also wear this double holster now, instead of this normal holster. Perfect. That's just a meeting, it's Night stick. Take it. Glue. Hell yeah. Matches. I'll take them. Because once we run out of things to light our cigarettes with, we're kind of screwed. Okay. 
anything in the fridge. Nope. That's the back door. I don't want to go out that way. Eyes are clear. I'm actually going to close this door, I think. Yep. Let's check this room first. Clear. 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 Our guy is so wet. Disassemble door. Okay, anything in here? Nope. Okay, I was actually hoping for something to be in there. Looks like we're a little less wet. Before we head back out there, let's go ahead and wait. I don't have anything to... Mm. I have anything to replace the bandage with. We're gonna have to disinfect that when we get back to the car. Ugh, oh, sometimes I'm just an idiot. Also, where the hell's my nightstick? Apparently I can't put it on my back. I put it in the holster? Damn, if only, right? No, pick that back up. What are you doing? I think that's where I want to go for the armory. But first... Bulletproof vests. Hey, there we go. Bulletproof vest. Oh, yeah. It's going to put our weight up, but it's also going to help us survive the zombies. Okay. That's just a shower. I'm assuming this is like a changing room then, or a toilet. All right. bag though. Ugh. I could carry that on my offhand. If I did that, I don't know. It seems like a waste. Never mind. This motorcycle helmet, huh? We're trying to see one of those, I think. Nothing back here. The next place to look is this door, which, like I said, I think leads out to armory. Yep, I don't care about finding useful stuff. But the door, I just care about tearing that motherfucker down. All right, what do we got? Oh, baby, you shouldn't have. I don't even know if we're going to be able to use all this, but let's take it. Was that three of those? I just I just looked. Ooh. Well, well, well. We got ourselves a shotgun, ladies and gentlemen. Also, this foreman vest I just realized we uh, don't need. Huh? 
the attach. Panel straps, choke full. Can I not put the sling on this? I can. Mm. One moment. I forget how I have to do this. Um. Let's unequip. And then if I go. No, do I have to remove an upgrade? Am I like limited to how many upgrades I can have on it? No. Is it the ammo straps then? It is. Alright, let's put the sling on. And what's the choke do? Shock on attack from first narrow or blast and increased damage. Right that it already does like maximum damage. I don't really know, but well then I can put on so I guess the uh ammo straps. And uh doing that. Alright. Both hands, let's go. I say, but I'm actually gonna put this on here. And then can we put this on my back? Here we go. Excellent. All right. Grab the rest of this. I don't know if any of these magazines are going to come in handy, but let's take them anyway. I already have, like, a bunch of M9s, right? Yeah. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to... I think we also have another one out there, too, right? In the, uh... Rock. Might as well take that. All right, what about this last thing down here? Paper clips. All right, nothing else. Good. Excellent. Um, hold on to that for now. All right, so we just got to get out, get to the truck, and offload some of our stuff, and disinfect this wound. Well, we are a little hungry, but I don't think I have anything to eat on me right now. Let me in. Let me in. Okay. Let's take a minute. I'm just going to see if I can throw anything in here. I cannot everything else has to go into here, which it can barely do. Alright, let's... I'm gonna grab some alcohol wipes, and... We have another bandage in here. Okay, remove the bandages. We need to disinfect it. And let's go ahead and use an adhesive bandage on that bad boy. There we go. All right. I fit anything in here now? I'm just carrying so much now, dudes. I managed to get some rounds in here, I guess. All right, do I have any food in this area? I do. Eat some crackers. We're we'll gonna eat what we can a little bit here. Why don't we go ahead and open this canned tomato and eat it as well? Just go ahead and eat it all. We are doing a lot of running around and it is making us lose weight. So, um, but I can just drop it on the ground. Sadly, I can't. Okay, some more stuff will fit in here now. That's perfect. Now I really need a van. Or something with more seats or something, man. Okay. Um. Well. If this is the case, let's go ahead and stash this stuff. Best we can, just in our bag here. Hopefully lessen our load as much as we can. And then, uh... 
Asleep. Alright. Not the best sleep we've ever had, but that'll be fine. Real quick, just check the quality of <laughs> Wish I hadn't done that now. Yeah, no wonder our uh, our brakes are just like shot. Alright. Let's see if we can get a new vehicle here, shall we? I'll take this lighter and the bandages. Shoot. No key in the ignition. I could hotwire it. That would take some time. I'll check the other ones anyway. This has 174 room in the back. Any keys on the ground? What's, what's that? Doesn't look like it. Like wrench, don't care. What about this black van over here? Surely, surely it has keys in the ignition, right? No. That's not good. Um, okay. He has a shotgun on him, though. Let's give these guys a try. Any keys or anything on you guys? No, but this guy had a another shotgun. I'm not gonna take it though, because well, I don't have the room. I'm gonna have to kill this one. I'm gonna try to hotwire the uh, the white van down there. I think. Well, maybe I should check the condition about these two. Let's see down here real quick. Storage capacity 174. Up north, we have storage capacity of 208. Okay, how's this one look in terms of ability? Looks really good. The rear windshield is bad, but everything else is freaking brilliant. So, I think this is going to be our new vehicle. And I believe I can hotwire it. Key? What do you mean key? Where did I get a key for this? Huh? Was the key in the ignition the whole time and I'm just dumb, guys? Is that what happened? If that's the case, I'm gonna be like really upset. Uh, before we take stuff out, let's go ahead and put stuff in and drop stuff we do not need on the ground. Okay. I'm also going to take this gas can. Put this tin can on the ground there. Alright. Because we'll siphon the gas out of the truck to fill up our, uh, our new vehicle. Why am I so wet? It's so bizarre. Maybe I should go back to the uh, the firehouse and use the um things there to fix up my clothing issue. I don't even know if it's a clothing. Maybe I'm just sweaty as hell for some reason. Whew. 
Why did that music start playing, huh? Huh, you little shits? What are you playing at? I, I kind of forgot that we could lockpick vehicles. Or not necessarily lockpick them, but, you know. Hotwire them. So I forgot we had this lunchbox. I just hope that the, uh, yeah, I figured as much. All right, let's toss out the stale food. I'll just eat this banana while it's fresh. This muffin to you. Nope, never mind. Alright, that's the trunk of the, or I guess the bed of the truck done. So now we just have everything else inside of it. Let's start with the glove box here. Alrighty. Now the car seat. Shit. Hey, bud. Hey, don't mind me. Was it just those three down there that decided to get up at him and try to come at me? I guess just the one decided to do that. The other ones are just kind of being dumb. Well, now that we found a huge truck, um, we will definitely be able to carry everything we need, really. So, that won't be too much of an issue. I'll just eat this fresh thing now. All right, moving on. Grab the rest of the stuff. And while that's going on, the firefighter jacket is wet. Damn it! Get 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 out of the fucking car! I don't know what lured you guys over here, but not nice. Don't try to bite me. How dare you. You know who I am? I'm a criminal. I'll bite you back. Alright, they didn't have jack on them. Wait a second. Put some more stuff in here, I guess. There's so many magazines for stuff. Hey, bud, you want to just not? You get. Okay. <clears throat> Is there anyone else around who wants a piece of this real quick before I continue... Throwing stuff between my vehicles. There's a couple of people over there. Let's hopefully get rid of this stuff before we run into them. Yes, we have the... Just, well, just a couple of things. Okay. God, Jesus Christ. All right, back in the car. I think of another zombie sneaks up on me. I'm just going to go, like, take this car and just run with it for a little bit. I'm not going to get out again. That's kind of what could lead to bad things happening. Yes, phone. Thank you very much. Okay. I think I might take the stuff that's in the lunchbox as well. At least the stuff that's not perishable. Put it in here too. Go, and then we'll just eat this real quick like and then I can just drop this so we're not carrying it all right time to siphon gas I 
everything perfect all right go ahead and throw this empty gas can in the back of the truck as well with our nightstick i'm just gonna sleep in the van <sighs> where it's relatively safe let's go ahead and have a smoke lower that anxiety down a little bit all right, so we're gonna run across here. I just interrupted my smoke, didn't I? Every other time it like waits until I'm done before it opens up. Anyway, we're gonna run across here, use the fire stations. Um, uh, laundry place real quick. And come back and then head towards the jail. I remember last time we were here, there was a couple of zombies in and around it. Just have to be careful. Yeah, there they are. Let's breathe nice and quiet, like. I don't know if those ones will still be inside here or not. Hopefully the answer is no, and we can just... Come on. One at a time. Let's go. Ooh, a key ring. Hold on. Do you have a key ring, huh? I'm just place that on the ground. I'll take your key for myself. Again, I don't know what any of these keys are for, but keys are nice to have. Nothing on him. I think it was the far end here. Yep. All right, which one's the dryer? Washer. Are they both washers? How do you guys dry your shit then? Oh my god, man. Don't let me hear y'all. Is there no dryer? Okay. Well, we might as well uh, fill up our water while we're here then. Let's go ahead and wash our bloody stuff too while we're at it. I think that's it, just the helmet. I don't know how the helmet got bloody. It's not like I'm headbutting people here, but okay. I wonder if it's on purpose that the firefighters do not have a uh, washer dryer and it's just a washer. The next closest place is further up, and I really don't want to go back to a town up here, but this chance to catch a cold is not good. Catching a cold could be the death of us if we're trying to sneak around, so we're going to have to... First of all, jump this so I can see back here. Make sure there's no zombies around. I can jump this again. I think there was a fall fence over there. Anyway, we'll sneak into this house. Actually, you know what? Never mind. Let's not do that. We have this house here that we've already been in, so we're going to use this one. Okay. And here's the laundry room. Ugh, okay. Clothes dryer, perfect. That's soaked. That is soaked. That's dirty and soaked. Dirty. That's dirty. I guess dirty doesn't matter, but... I think I would have to fill it, wouldn't I? That one's wet. Okay. Go ahead and turn that on. 
then we'll go ahead and sit and wait for it to finish. Did it finish? Looks like it did. All right. Where all that? Hopefully we won't catch a cold for sure now. How's our hand doing? Looking pretty good. Right, before we head out one more time, let's go ahead and drink. Fill our water bottle. All right back to the van. I guess it's a truck technically, no, but whatever. All right, so let's jump this chain link fence. I said, let's jump the chain link fence, man. How are my stats looking? We are very nimble. Barely lose any speed when we're uh, walking around like this. You know? Sprinting's also gaining a little bit. What we really need to do is gain our uh, our damaging abilities here. Right, I just want to take a moment here. Yeah, give me this wrench. So the one we're gonna toss on the ground just to get it out of the way there. All right, and then. Fancy work here. Level myself up a little bit in some things. Uh, headlights, headlights, headlights. Can't uninstall. Okay, that did nothing for our mechanics. I was hoping it would at least increase it a little bit, but it apparently did not. So that's fine. Um, I will, however, take all of this stuff after we read this Louisville map. Yep. We're just going to go ahead and toss all this stuff out. I do not need it. All right. Head, Fred. Luckily, this is in basically perfect condition. All right, so now we're going to head to the prison where the next leg of our journey will begin. Oh, perfect. The brakes on this are so much better. I just had to like brake check now. Of course, because we're going so fast, it's uh, a little bit dangerous. I can just go through these, right? Yeah, okay. We're going to park right here. I know it's kind of like a weird and awkward place, but kind of central to all the cars so that's what we're gonna do um beef jerky eat all of it all right so before we get too far into all of this uh we're basically just going to first of all re-equip my nightstick here Try doing what we can. Try to secure ourselves front gate at least. We're too nimble now. Check the back. We're good.
Got him. All right. Is that a the round rush? Except for those guys. Yes. We're just going to walk away real quick, like, so they don't hopefully catch on to us real quick. I should put the wrench back away, too. There we go. All right. So, we have secured our immediate area. We're going to sleep in the van. Where it's nice and safe. Who panicked to sleep? Okay, well, that'll go away in a moment, so. There we go. Not safe to sleep here. Now it is. Get wrecked. What? What? Come on, kill him here. One zombie must be like going in and out of range. Yeah, boy. Got it just in time. Hell yeah. All right, folks. Well, we've uh, done a lot today. Checked out the cop shop, got the pharmacy, we got the firefighter's department, and we made it to the. Uh, Excuse me. And we made it here to the prison. Next, we raid the prison. True criminal. We're going to the prison. I suppose for lore purposes, we could say that uh, Devin, no last name here, is uh, trying to find one of his friends who got put away a while ago. Hopefully they're not still a zombie, but they're probably going to be a zombie. Anyway... Our, uh, our boy Dilvin, Devin, blah, will be uh, continuing his journey. We'll slowly start to clear the surrounding area real quick. I'm going to start with probably these guys up there, try to lure a couple away at a time. Then we'll go over, move, secure the front gate. And uh, after that, move actually into the prison proper. See if we can find, you know, guns. I'm, I'm sure there's, like, some good shotguns in there, if nothing else, for, like, riot control and stuff like that. So we'll see how that goes. Well, until next time, bye for now.